Hello everybody and welcome to episode 6 of Alien Isolation here on Wm 2 d Gaming. I was like, when you start talking and saying the intro and stuff, I always like, you know, I, like try to like predict the words you're saying, like just how you say it. And every time it's like, it takes two because it took so long to go through that game. That game was horrible to us? Yeah. Traumatized us. I am traumatized. So what did we do last time, Jack? Die. The alien's literally, like, right there. Alien, mad girl. So, where are we going? I'm gonna open the map a lot in this playthrough. I want everyone to know that. The map is very important. I can't read it. What do you mean you can't read it? I, d I don't understand the shapes. I don't want to be in this room anymore. You mean don't understand the shapes? So what was it, A29, A21? Sure. I'm sure you have it in your uh, objectives. Like this isn't one of them, I'm just coming in here real quick. Just want to uh, hide for a second, that's all. Imagine if I turned the alarm on myself. Like, if you go to your map? Yeah, we, we have to look for the rooms. Oh, I thought I was going to tell you. It well, was... it shows you A20... Well, that shows where you were at. It so. wasn't A27. It was A29 and A26, and I think C1. We're dead. Is it right? It never came in, right? I don't think she came in. I think it opened when she walked by. If she comes in, we're dead. Yeah. She didn't move. Is she standing right there? She's gatekeeping, and I hate it. <laughs> I hate when she does this. Oh, it's so annoying. She does this some a lot. How am I gonna get out of this unless I throw it and run again? I wonder if the air purifications uh, also make it harder for her to sniff you out. She went that way? Right, this is one of them? A26? Right, I just want to know where she's at real quick. I want to know if she was like sprinting at us. Because you know, when I run, then she hears. Like, there's no getting around that. Mm -hmm. That's not working. Bonding agent. Is that what I wanted to do? Please don't go open the door and see me. <laughs> I'm so nervous right now. I guess she's just stopped. Nope. She's coming. We're good. Yeah, key card, because I think, you know what? I think the door's back the way that she was prowling. That should have been our first hint, honestly. You know what I mean? Yeah. Is she coming? Is there a vent area right here? I mean, there's a vent in the wall, but... Like you see over there? No, she's right above us. 
I'm not sure. She can't come out of the ceiling randomly. She has to come out of a vent. Oh, that's right. We can hide under things. If she comes out of that, I'm dead. I think she gave up her chase for now. Nope. That's her. Mm hmm. I feel like we're wasting so much time. I just don't want to die. Oh, well, that's understandable to everyone else watching. She went down right where I need to go. I think she's... might be the room that we're looking for. Probably I guess the, with the bodies. I feel bad because I get so quiet, but I get quiet because I'm so nervous. You know? Mm-hmm. Because we haven't saved, and we don't know where the autosave is. I think that's the key card to get into the next area. That's the worst part. It's just going to shut the blind. Oh, no. That was what we needed. No. You picked up the key card. Yeah, but there was another door that required a key card. Yeah, so you think we can take that back now? That red X? Because we picked up the key card? Well, would it stay red X on the map if... I think so. I get so there. If it, like, if it literally walks in this room, it's over? He's literally shaking in his chair, <clears throat> folks. Shaking in my boots? Slam it shut on you. I know, like that. You're like, yeah. you think it would hear it? Where is she going? I like, is that her walking around? She, she's in the ceiling. Alright, she went in the ceiling. So <clears throat> now we got time. We went, we didn't have to go in there before, so. Oh, but that's right. The thing's on the other side. That sucks. She's a looking. She's in the ceiling right now. You think she's out? Pretty sure she's in the ceiling. Well, she's right across the hallway. Definitely ceiling. And the vent she's gonna come out is close to you. Vent's to my left. Mm -hmm. She's still in the ceiling though. So I feel like we could take that key card back. So why don't you go back? I don't know why you're second guessing yourself. Just go back. It's the directive tells you to go back, go back. Yeah, that's what I thought. Mainly because I didn't want to get eaten by the alien, Jack. You're just like, well, I'm not sure if the key card that I'm supposed to get is going to work. So what point of you getting the key card? I am aware of that. But I didn't want to die because obviously she's still around. You know, like, I want to sprint. <clears throat> There's definitely times to sprint, but I didn't, wasn't sure if that was the right time. Damn you, Coleman! You knew that thing was here! Now, of course he did. There. I thought it might be there. There's a difference. Now, the passcode. 1702, okay? Now let's get down to the dispensary. Of course, of course. A promise is a promise. He's I'm not sorry. sorry. I'm going to step into the other room to punch the code in and prime the elevator. Then we can use the key card to take the elevator down. 
I don't believe him. Do, I, do we really believe him at all? Oh, look, there's two things now. Isn't that exciting? There. I'll collect oh, no. my things and we can leave. And look, there's a vent right above him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's fine. <laughs> like, we probably shouldn't have her. He's fine. Where's the lower hospital behind us? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! <laughs> we were right there. No, we completed it. We completed the mission. So did we successfully do it? Did we die? I think you died, darling. Oh, we were right there. You weren't, though. Oh. You took too long. Jack's favorite thing is that I jumped. <laughs> he jumped and squealed. Oh. We were right there. Did I break it? I feel like we broke it. We have the car, and it said return to him. <laughs> he just checked your thing, and I was like, that seems a lot closer than he normally is. I pulled it up, and I saw that it blinked to my right, and I, in my head I was just like, I'm in danger. And, I was like, and then I was like, oh no. <laughs> That's some crap. Damn you, Coleman! You knew that thing was That's here. such crap. <laughs> I like how we were silent the entire time too, but neither of us were on the talk. We're just like, hmm. Of course, of course. A promise is a promise. I'm sorry for putting you through this. I'm going to step into the other room to punch the code in and prime the elevator. So you should go to the elevator. As soon as he starts talking, I'm going to the elevator. Oh, that was such shit. Oh, I'm so mad. Oh, we can't even save because of this? Okay. Yep. Yeah. There. I'll collect my things and we can leave. <laughs> See you, nerd. <laughs> oh, we didn't get to hear him scream? I'm so just dis like disappointed. Like we both were like sitting there, and then I was like, "Oh no!" As soon as I pulled up, that's so comedical too. It's like, "Hmm, oh no." <laughs> uh, and she's right there. She's coming. I can't wait for you to come up with titles for all of this. Yeah. So we're trying, or at least I'm trying, to get Jack to do these long recording sessions so that we can work on November's recordings. Jack does not like that idea. No. Nope. Jack wants to be in bed until it's, it's only 4 o'clock. Yep. Jack gets CP. Yeah, and I get terrified. What's the difference? Which was that life? Isn't the Stumbaton for the Xenomorph? It's super useless. No, it's not for the androids. Is it? It might be. It's right there. But it's in the ceiling right now? Huh. I have to go through that vent, don't I? Yep. Yeah? Yeah. Well, do we actually check this middle yet? No, no, we're good. Oh, oh yeah, because it takes uses on top of it. God, we're so bad. You're bad. That's rude. 
We're a team. So if I'm bad, you're bad? How dare you put this on me. Can't pick up the scrap. And that's what we were supposed to push in. But can we make anything? <clears throat> um, we can make a smoke bomb. Can we make a noisemaker? No. We could actually make an EMP mine. Uh, flashbangs. I feel like we really don't have a use for them. Pipe bombs would be interesting. Med kit. We can't make. Uh, yeah. So I guess that's it. I have to hit the link in here. Mm -hmm. Uh, zoom. Do you have to press something else first? Do I have to get another one, maybe? Oh, you need another coolant to put in there. Oh, there's coolant on that side, too. That's true. So maybe we're never going in that room, but we're going in this room. No, we definitely need uh, two more, or one more. Um, did this say anything important? That's to hide. That's so the alien can kill me. Why would you want these pictures in your area? Armax medical bandages. Like, if we could go through that vent, it might bring us where we need to go. But we need to find the trauma kit. And that means we need to find more hydrogen. So like we are going in here for sure. I, I think I'm gonna keep running from now on. <clears throat> running seems like the best plan of action here. It just came out, didn't it? Sound like it. <laughs> as soon as I heard the scream, I knew there was nothing I could do. Yep. Alright, so we'll just do it this time again, but faster? <laughs> faster and instead of immediately going to the computer, listen to see if she comes out. I don't think I actually need to go to the computer, that's the thing. To activate it? Yeah. yeah. You gotta press the button. No, because the other room opened without pressing it. Yeah, because this room opened up, I'm pretty sure, without pressing the button. I'm guessing we have to come in here first. I think we activated it the first time. Oh, yeah, so you already activated it. So and then you had to push the stuff in. Okay. Yeah. The worst thing is that we have to rebuild everything. We want to take it. You know, she probably jumped down too because I was sprinting. Mm -hmm. You were just like, yeah, I'm gonna sprint everywhere. I feel like this best option is if she comes up and stabs you. I mean, we do need to sprint places, so. I think part of it is because she was right above us when I started sprinting. Smart, smart. Well, I think she came out this time. Well, it took a second for you to log into the computer, so give her a second. No, she's going away from us. That's good. Muy bueno. So 
So I think I'm going to quickly save and then we'll go in that room. Alright. She's a thumping. I know and I hear it and I'm, it's one of those things like, do I really want to save? <laughs> Wait for it to just jump down and just come full sprint at me? Mm hmm Okay. So, what are we looking for in here? Or what are we looking for? Trauma kit? Yes, trauma kit. Trauma kit. Trauma kit? There's a Dr. Lingard, senior medical officer. Seriously though, you know, like thinking Should about it. Find out where they're keeping everything in her office. The worst thing that literally could have happened to us was turning to the right and it being right there earlier. Like that was <laughs> literally straight out of like a horror movie. <laughs> and I was like, I think it's weird. He's not talking to us, and that's even worse because that means he just watched us die. He's just like, you know what? They'll do better next time. I wonder if it was, if it, like, that's something that can just happen sometimes, or, like, when you reload. I mean, I feel like the game broke, period, because of, like, what happened to begin with. Well, no, I think he didn't activate because she was in the area. Yeah, I mean, that would make sense. But just thinking back on it, that's, like, it's hilarious, because that, that couldn't have been scripted. Like, who could have ever predicted that was going to happen to us? I didn't predict it. I didn't predict it. I was, I was just like, oh man, I guess you're gonna have to reload or something because he's not activating. That was like right red, I swear, for a second. Well, she's definitely in here with us again, so. Mm -hmm. She missed you. Definitely the big angry. I think she ate some people. What do you think? I don't think she really eats him. I think she just kills him. And there's no place to hide either. Is she out? No. It's hard for me to tell when she's just in the in the vent well you know it's also difficult because we're we have airpods and one of us each has one so it's uh you know we're not getting clear crystal sound of like what's going on around us remember where this is because i think i need that later the green box yeah i don't even know where we're at right now and yeah that is part of it like reach sharing a headphone so sometimes i only hear things and she only hears things. But you know, uh, shit happens. Yeah. Right now she's up in the ceiling. Let's get that save in, because I love being able to save. Yeah, tastes good. Imagine if we were playing on nightmare mode right now. No. Why? Because... Yeah, like, we have to do it all in one sitting. You, uh, I need you to remember that code. 2505. 2505. That's funny, because we had everything written down at one point. Now we can burn the, the Xenomorph. Remember that pressure. I mean, I didn't really need to remember because it's right here, so... Samuels, I'm on my way. I feel like she's out. No, she's not. There's nothing down there. I feel like we really haven't angered her a whole lot yet. I think the times we angered her, she ate us. Fuck! That's really unfortunate. I did not know there was a vent. Should I have just ran, you think? Where would you have gone?
uh, somewhere to hide. But yeah, I assumed you were gonna hide and you just kinda crouched around the corner. Isn't there a locker right there? Yeah, but I feel like she would have noticed that. I feel like she would have noticed you sitting there. You think so? She did. What if we just don't trigger that? Samuels, I'm on my way. She's out, right? It sounds it. Yeah, it sounded like it. But now where is she? She's over there. Like, do I have to trigger that? Where are you supposed to go? We're supposed to walk around, like, to the other area where the flames were? Yeah, she's out. Yeah, I see that. Just in case you weren't sure. I don't think I can make it to that locker. I don't know if we made it to the locker, but I don't think we did. I don't think so either. I want to hit the RB bumper so bad, because that's the one that pulls up the thing, but that's if she hears it and we're dead anyway. Mm -hmm. You hear growling, right? Yes, I do. Very, very much okay. so. Well, now we wait. Either we die right here in this locker, which is probably going to happen. I'm still upset that we didn't get the Xbox mode to, uh, for them to hear the mic. No, we don't need that. Apparently it was really bad, and that's why they didn't port it to PC like that. Like it didn't work? No, it worked, but uh, I guess anything like if there was any background noise, like if the mic just picked up like the dog breathing, or like if I just took my phone, I was just like, they would hear it, and it was pissing everyone off. Like, people were getting really mad about it. I feel like she went up a vent. But I'm scared regardless. I don't know. Well, we can do one thing. We can end the video right here. Thank you everybody for watching episode 6 of Alien Isolation. Yay. Please like, comment, subscribe. We didn't die to the Xenomorph. To Wait, did we die to the Xenomorph? Yeah, we just died yes. to it. What am I talking about? We did. <laughs> but we're making the progress. Yeah. So stay tuned for episode 7. Yay. Sevastopol. Sevastopol. Bye. Weirdo. Sevastopol.